hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in to another one of my videos it is a total mess in here guys but i'm super super stoked i've been super busy with clearance shopping dumpster diving so we have a lot to talk about we have so much to talk about that i'm actually going to do this video either in separate parts or maybe one video and then another because i've been diving a lot um i don't know what's going on but these stores have been throwing away a lot of stuff and um one of our stores um they were going out of business so i got some good clearance finds for my poshmark and i will be sharing that with you guys later on in another video but right now let's dive into this video today um i am going to let me see all right so i'm gonna do dollar general another five below and some bath and body works today how's that and then i have another one i'll do in a separate video so yeah sounds good that way it doesn't take up too much time so let's get started all right guys so on this table here and right here we're going to start with dollar general so starting with this right here look at this this is some cute little wreaths um I'm going to assume you can put them on your door or graveyards. Um, they're really cute guys. And they were just put in plastic bags. So there's no damage. Look, many of them still have the tags on them. They're so cute. I think this one right here is for a grave. These are going to be going to a friend of mine. So... They're going to go to a good place. She's going to put them on her family's grave. Here is a, um, a microfiber mop. This is going to go to her as well. Over here, I have a bag, a birthday bag. Um, and here... I pulled all of this newspaper out because I am going to need it. Apparently, I have to move again because my landlord apparently needs her home back because I don't know if they lost their home or, you know, there's a lot going on with this whole COVID thing. And she said that she needs to move her and her family back in this home. So... All I can do is find another place, but hopefully we find a bigger place with the garage because my stock room is getting full. Anyways, so I'm going to need a lot more newspaper, but I pulled this out for now. Um, we have these little guys. This one, he kind of lost his eye somewhere in the dumpster, but there was no need to leave him there. I guess they just are like little shelf ornaments because the bottom is heavy. Um, so we got four of them. These guys, I don't know. Um, I had one of these to actually like three or four. This was a whole case. These are delicious. They are organic fruit snacks. And mm, they are amazing. I pulled this out as well it's a little coloring book this is um it's a bag that goes over a basket like a gift basket um wrapping type bag over here is some more clothes that i found some little bottoms um a little pair of tights i didn't find the top to this little girl's bathing suit but I took that so we just have some different um articles of clothing here I couldn't find for some reason the other part of them they were outfits but let me see yeah so for this one 
I got the whole outfit. Yay! And I don't think, let's see, is this, no. Well, I thought I had the whole outfit for that, but I guess not. Here is a pair of sweatpants, jogging pants that say good vibes. And this is just some more clothing. Um, these I am going to have to wash. They did get a little bit wet even though they were in plastic because as you all know, we here in Louisiana have had a ton of rain. Um, over here, I can't go around because of these clothes racks. So I'm going to do the best I can from this angle. We have some, um, some women's vitamins, some prenatal multivitamins here. I'm not sure what these are, guys, but I have a whole stack of them. I think it's something like you make uh, the wreaths, you know, flowers and stuff like that. Got a stack of them. Right here. Let's see. I have a couple of these. Just some little home decor you hang on your wall. I've got a bunch of these little Eiffel Towers. This is some more flowers. We're going to put this over there. I think it went to something else. And I didn't um, get to find out what well, the other part of it. So I took that. Um, I've been finding a bunch of little... Um, oh, this is wireless ear hooks I think it may be missing a part I haven't even opened this yet to find out I just kind of laid it out and trying to been uh, trying to get to a place where I can make this video it's just taking a few days I got a bunch of these a pack of Hawaiian punch candies um there was a few of these. These are some type of appetite control vitamins or something. Home sweet home. Got some hair dye. I got two. Never been opened. This little thing here. A hummingbird feeder. Got some coffee back there. Um, some little containers still in a plastic, never been opened. This balsamic vinegar has never been opened. None of this stuff has been opened. Um, that way I don't have to tell you guys for everything. Obviously, it wouldn't be on my table if it's been opened. And if it is open, it's because a member of my family opened it. So, we got some Pepto-Bismol, Dial uh, Body Wash, the trial size, a spoon, a pair of socks. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I don't really watch much TV, so I have no idea who these people are. But, this is a pair of socks. They're made of very comfortable material. I don't know why they would throw this stuff away. Got some of these little things. Which is great because I'm going to scare the crap out of my son. He's always doing it to me. He's always popping bottles, plastic water bottles, making a lid fly off, doing crazy stuff. Well, I'm going to get him back. I got to make sure they work though because I think they may have gotten a little wet. Um, let's see, we have one bottle of this. Not sure what this is, but I got it. Got a box of these tampons. They just kind of popped them open, like, but none of them came out. There was a pack of these. My son, my youngest son, he's been stealing from the pool table. Um, got a little puppy here. 
a bunch of band-aids that they just kind of threw in a plastic bag some little hooks you can hang a plant from or something yep there it is a bag of Jolly Ranchers that is almost gone because again I have kids a cute little troll pin not sure what this is but I think it's broken hmm it went to something and I don't see what it went to I think my son may have uh, knocked something off the pool table but anyways moving on car air fresheners I took that out the package the package was wet a pack of landscaping pins um, a charging brick a bandana a whoopee cushion some paint brushes got some bubbles over here guys is um some organic suckers lollipops and a bunch of boxes of these jungle cookies got a Hershey's bar here now this I took out the box but they are good they are crackers guys look at this this is a case of Twinkies that was not even opened I opened it and gave away two boxes there was a couple more boxes of these hostess cupcakes I gave a couple boxes of them away we got some ding-dongs and look one two three four five there was another case of M&M candy bars and I gave one away whole cases never been opened how crazy is that and then there was um, a case that was open so I just grabbed the candy bars and left the case some zebra cakes and oh I took this out of the box this guys is a brand new twin size air mattress brand new and I have it um they may have popped a hole in it or something I'm not sure I have not tested it out so moving along in these boxes now these boxes were never opened I picked them up from five below just tossed in the dumpster so naturally I couldn't wait till I got home to see what I had and there are two cases I think only two cases of these create your own face mask how cool is that so I'm thinking about maybe seeing if I could sell these on my Poshmark I know you can sell a lot of stuff on Poshmark so I don't see why not and this is something um let's see one kitty figurine four markers one paint brush and four paints so it's something you know like a little activity um for little kids but there's a whole case there this is another case of the create your own masks oh gosh and let's see this is a bunch of 3D paint and squishy kits. I love finding stuff like this, guys. I'm just going to add it to my stockpile. And I'm always giving away stuff. So I love to just bless people and give. So dumpster diving has allowed me to do some pretty awesome things. Make some people happy. Here's another case. Oh gosh, I forgot about all of these cases. Let's see. Oh, this is going to go with another haul, guys. As is this one. So, look at these. This is like um scrapbook kits. A whole case of them. Gosh, I'm so excited. 
to find stuff like this and I don't know why they throw stuff like this away like why not donate it to you know maybe a woman's shelter you know because they have these battered women's shelters where the women and the kids um go there oh so there was three cases of the masks that I found so there's that that All right, so all of this right here, not this, but all of this stuff, guys, was found at Five Below. Unopened, I was just pulling the, the cases out, anxiously awaiting the moment to get home, unload them, and see what it was I found. And this air mattress and everything on this table, everything on this table came from Dollar General. And in the same night, um, I hit a Bed Bath & Beyond dumpster where... I got all of these hand washes. Some of them, or most of them, they broke the pumps on, but that's okay. This, um, I think there's three of them. I don't remember which dumpster they came out of, but I need to wipe them down. So, there's three of these, and the rest are all bath and body works this one just look at how attractive that bottle is right on time Halloween is right around the corner guys my favorite time of the year um this is some puzzle uh, not puzzles posters I'm not sure oh Lizzo Got them dumpster diving. And here is two candles. Now, one, I actually found four. One is burning in my room. And here's these two. Um, the one that's burning in my room and these two right here, they broke. But I could still put them on a plate and burn them. And they will still smell the same. There was a bunch of these um, plugins, so I took them. I found a toilet seat cover, never been opened. I think that's pretty cool that you can buy these to put um to carry with you to put on the toilet seats. However, I still don't sit on them. And this came out of an Ulta dumpster. Obviously, I have to wash these, but I couldn't just leave them. Got a little bit of makeup. Um, there were three makeup bags and just a little bit of makeup. I was able to save a few. Well, I don't know. Maybe that can be used if I unscrew that. Huh, I didn't notice that. And then there's this one. I mean, they literally try to destroy everything in the dumpsters around here, guys. So, I'm happy to find cases of things. I'm happy to find things that are not destroyed. Alright, so there you have it. Dollar General, Five Below, and Bath and Body Works. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul um, just as much as I did showing it to you guys. And I was supposed to go diving last night and I missed the opportunity because I literally have no place to put it at this moment. Because I have another haul that I'm going to go ahead and um, do the video right after this one. So you will see me wearing the same clothes. I'm just going to do it that way because it makes the video um 
it's not as long if I do it that way. So, anyways, guys, thank you so much for tuning in to see what I found in a dumpster. Um, please take a moment to subscribe, comment, click that bell so you never miss a time when I upload. And I will see you guys next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.